cool party people it is Wednesday it's Wednesday uh, it's just after 10 did I sleep in until 10 I did not I tried I slept about six hours and 50 minutes which is what I have been sleeping forever like that amount of time and which I thought might be an issue and it was so I woke up but I stayed in bed and I just laid in bed and I did not do anything I didn't go on the internet I put on some more white collars so I watched some white collars so I could fall asleep to that didn't really work um but here I am I am conscious I am going to cross off sleep in on my list even though I didn't really sleep in but I did stay in bed for quite a while and um, I've got the oven preheating upstairs so I can make myself some breakfast and um, yeah and um yeah <laughs> we're off to a good start this morning I feel like I have so much stuff to do so much stuff to do so much stuff to do so I will get to that eventually but for now, I don't, I don't even know. For now, I don't know. I just don't know. <laughs> okay, I am slightly more conscious than I thought things through a bit. Organizing my desk is the first thing. So I got my laptop here. It's not organized, but it's better. And then I think once I make my bed, I'll feel better about that because then it'll just be that mess in the back there. So I think that's the best way to go. So I'm just gonna, I've got a couple of emails I have to send off and other adulting things. So I think I'm gonna work on those a bit, but also in a couple I have to go up and remember that I need to cook food. Also I had weird dreams that I was back at work and they wouldn't let me off the island. Like, I was like, aren't we leaving today? And then like, oh no, it's too late now. Maybe tomorrow. And I'm like, I can't leave tomorrow. I have to leave today. So it was weird. There was, there were puppies. I was cooking food inside the store. And I, like my lunch, like I guess I didn't get to leave for lunch or something. And I was like, oh no, it's burning. And then my potato patty hash browns, which is what I'm about to cook. They like just turned to mush. Like they were inedible. So hopefully that doesn't happen to the real ones. But yeah, so I'm going to... Work on, I think I have like four emails I have to send off. Oh, the real world, just take me back to the island. And, um, etc. Well, hello again. I'm wearing clothes. Not really, kind of. They're sweatpants. What do you expect from me? I wore jeans so many days this summer and like capri jeans because like the, it just wasn't sunny. It wasn't sunny like I thought it would be. But I have a bunch of things from Amazon because I have a problem. I was in the middle of nowhere. What do you expect me to do? I need to find like scissors to open said things. Scissors! Um, yeah, I was in the middle of nowhere so I was like, hey, let's buy stuff on Amazon. This is what I do. It did it when I was there in November, which is why I have my lovely new <laughs> king size comforter and um, king size duvet, I guess. This lighting really isn't that great. What about that did nothing, but whatever, we're going with it. Hello? Okay, so I turned on the light for my room, which that makes sense, but my, my mom came in because she dropped off these packages because I got them sent to her place. So there's one box, there's another box, which you can't see, and then there's an envelope. So, fun times. I, I got, I got problems as I was saying, but they're in, they're in things I need. They're important things I need. I don't know what happened to my English. I think it's just having to use proper English, like speaking good English to people for like two and a half months. I'm just, I'm over it. I am just over it. Can we like come down a little bit more? Oh geez. Okay, that's a little bit better. So I think I mentioned how I destroyed my water bottle so much packaging. How I destroyed my water bottle by dropping it on the ground when I was having a rough day. So I got a new Brita water, water bottle. <laughs> new Brita water bottle to replace that one. Um, I really like the straw water bottles and I really like the Brita filter in it because then the water is always so fresh. So there. And I think I'm gonna finally get rid of this one that I've had for so many years. And um, I probably should get rid of it, just saying, because I can't clean it very well. I also, if you recall, when we had Secret Santa, um, I embroidered a thing, and it made me remember how much 
I loved the idea of embroidering because I was never really good at embroidering when I was younger, but I picked up this doodle stitching collection. So it's got like a bunch of different, you cannot see that, a bunch of different like cute little motifs and everything that I can copy and like trace maybe theoretically. I don't know. It should tell me about stitches too, which is very exciting. So there's that also apparently it has a CD in the back. Maybe I can like print designs. I don't know. So that's that. I want to get more embroidery stuff too, but I figured I should actually start embroidering before I'm like, yay, embroidering! Now this box is the much more fun box because it has stationary stuff in it. Because I have a problem. My mom is like, are you kidding me? Like we went to Walmart yesterday because I needed to get stuff. I'm like, I need to go check a very important section, the stationary section. And she was like, I know mother. I know. This is kind of like an excessively large box for the amount of stuff that is in here as you can see anyway but i know how amazon ships they're all like hey this is the perfect size box to go in this truck that's going to that place so you're getting it so mostly there's a few things i don't know english we're just we're just not we're not doing it well today so i bought an agenda from chapters indigo and Oh, there's a cobweb again. I'm just gonna close it. Bought, I, I know it's probably kind of loud. Anyways, I bought an agenda from Chapters Indigo, which is the same one that I always use. It's my go-to, it's my ride or die. Is it really my ride or die? Probably not. But I was thinking like maybe there's a better one out there. So I bought not one, but two other agendas. I want to have two agendas this year anyway because I want one for like my creative stuff and one for work stuff because I'm going to be working a lot, I feel, between blind channel stuff and work, work, theater stuff. So I just want to kind of separate them, maybe even have a personal one. I don't know, just have three, be, be ballin' with agendas. So I got this one. It's from Bando. Ho, 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 shiny. It says, I am very busy, which is the original saying on the um, agenda that I got from Bando. So this is a little bit bigger. It's so sparkly. It's so sparkly. Anyway, oh, there's 3D classes in here. Anyway, um, I got this one because it's a little bit bigger. And so I was hoping that maybe a little bit more space would be better. It's about the same layout though, but it does go until December 2020, whereas I'm pretty sure the one that I have now goes September to th <laughs> September through September. So yeah, this is pretty much the exact same one I have, just a little bit larger and way shinier. Because the one that I got, I don't know if you remember, it's so shiny. It um, is pink and it says you're exactly where you're meant to be, supposed to be, something like that. Anyways, I love the I'm very busy because it makes me feel like, yeah, I'm very busy and I'm killing it. So I got that one. And then this was the other one that I want to try and this is, significantly larger than I thought it would be. Like, I thought this would be closer to the size of this one, but this is basically a book. Way to read the measurements. <clears throat> so, it has, like, mucho espacio. Is that even right? Anyways, and this one goes all the way to June, so maybe this would be, like, my home one or something. I don't know. Anyways, so we're trying to be organized this year, so we've got options, and I'm too lazy to go get the other one behind me, but I'm... I'm just, I probably shouldn't use this one because it's very shiny and I will get so distracted. So distracted. Anyway, so I got those things. And then, so you know like moleskin notebooks? I like, I can't bring myself to pay like $30 for them. But we'll get to that. We'll get, I ordered a notebook that was maybe like almost as expensive. So uh, anyway, we'll get to that when that arrives. I, I can't bring myself to spend the ridiculous $30 on a notebook that I'm either not going to use because I'll be like, nah, I don't want to work on the story anymore, or that I'm going to go through very quickly. So I found these black ones, like this. It's a very good dupe. I have clearly destroyed it because I've used it so much. Like, I'm pretty sure, yeah, it's, it's full right to the end. I can't open that last page because dexterity issues. Yeah, it's full right to the end. Um, but this I found at Winners by a brand called Piccadilly, and I love it because it's got it's got the small lines and all that fun stuff. So 
I want to find, this is a great dupe for moleskin, and I want to find a comparable dupe, fingers crossed hopefully. So there's this Amazon Basics one that looks like it's going to be comparable and it's only about $12 versus 30-ish, 25, I don't know. So here it is, unpacked. It's very similar to the Piccadilly one. I feel, so I'm huge on page feel because I'm a very tactile person if you don't know that about me already. And so if the pages don't feel right, it stresses me out. I think it's okay. I'll have to write in it to know. Yeah, I'm literally just here stroking notebook pages. Um, I'll have to write in it to know, but it looks very promising so far. And so, hey, maybe we'll get a bunch of these in the future. But I stopped writing by hand as much though, which is very interesting. So who knows, maybe I'll never use this, but I do all my planning by hand, but I prefer, one second. My room that was a mess has just become more so, but I prefer to use big coil notebooks like this when I'm doing my planning. It's like big and spaced out. I can just scroll. I like that. Also, never, never, never give up Winston Churchill. He was a great orator. He had problems, but man, could he speak and didn't doesn't everybody have a problem? Anyway, continuing on with the planner situation. So, I just, I, I got a bunch of stickers. So there's like 575 stickers in here because I figured I needed a lot because so many agendas. So, yeah, those are cute. Looks like they've got a couple different designs. I also got this, this one here, da 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 da, like, affirmations and such what's this one also pretty happy these are like mostly from like the happy planner collection i've looked at the happy planners and i just they seem like too much effort i like things that are pretty much set to go i feel like with a happy planner you must put stickers and stuff in like it's it's like a requirement i know it's not but that's what i feel like in my head so that's why i get other agendas and then if i feel like putting stickers in them i have the stickers and if i don't it's cool too and then i got <laughs> This is awesome. Messy bun and getting stuff done. But yeah, so some more fun stickers. Another, like, 150 of these. Impossible is just an option. Blah, 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 blah. Another fun, be positive. Accidentally ordered the same one. Oops. I didn't realize this until, like, after I had ordered it. And for some reason, I was going through my order. And I was like, well, oh, yeah, that does say two. Anyway, and then, oh, shoot. <laughs> I did it twice for this one too. So I will definitely have like appointment and birthday stickers for, for life. The other one, I think I'm going to wait because this goes with something else that I haven't got yet. So I think I'm going to wait for that before I um, share what's in here. <laughs> I have problems. Anyway. I am now going to try to get back to being productive. Was I really being productive before? I made my bed and now it's covered in stuff. But laundry was what I was working on. So I am I'm going to continue working on that. And then hopefully I gotta go clean Pykel's cage because he is my responsibilité. Responsibilité. Oh, hello? Oui? What's hedgehog in French? Anyway. I don't even know. I'm going crazy. I have left the island of craziness and I have brought all the crazy with me. So I'm going to go now. I'm going to try to be productive. I got a huge list. Got to get stuff done. So I'm going to go do that starting with putting on my laundry and then taking care of Monsieur Michael. Okay, so I feel like I have made some progress. I don't remember what I mentioned, but I reached out to the electrician. I sent him an extremely lengthy email about everything I have observed and what I've done and such. And so he reached back out to me and he has suspicions of what it might be so that's good because last time he was here I, he was like I have no idea um so I just I'm waiting to hear back from my sister-in-law before I email him back with more details and he's gonna come by tomorrow yay adulting uh I'm also working on setting up my new agenda I think I'm gonna use oh my goodness it's so heavy the shiny one for my creative stuff because it's super shiny and then I'll use the other one for work. I guess I, I wrote down work stuff in my shiny one, but I should write it down in the other one. It's fine. I'm just gonna be super organized. I'm just like thinking about things. Anyway, so working on that, I tidied my bed off, so yay. That's exciting. I don't know if you can hear, but the laundry's going. I'm almost ready to switch it over to dry, which is very exciting. I can't stop doing this with my arm, and I don't know why. I need to eat soon. It's 1.30. I ate it 
about 11, but all I had were four hash brown patties, which did not screw up. It's very exciting because like, yeah, I had the dream about them screwing up and they were instead really delicious, which is exciting because the last time I had them, I was like, mm, potato hash brown patty thingies, but you know what, they were great. They were great, I loved them. Um, so yeah, I have a lengthy list to do today. It is so big that I had to get a second one of my, ah, uh, I had to go onto a second page, but we're getting through it rather quickly. When I Once I eat lunch, I get to cross another thing off because yes, that's why I have my to-do list. My to-do lists are like the random itty bitty things that I'm not gonna write in my agenda. Like I'm not going to write eat lunch in my agenda. I will write shower in my agenda because otherwise that ain't happening. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so that's me being the everything. The everything. So I think next up is feeding myself. Uh, which is just gonna be leftovers from last night because I still have some from dinner last night and then I think Sunday or writing a blog and then and then continuing to tidy my room finishing unpacking because I honestly I haven't done much over there I took out my dirty laundry and that's about it so anyways I'm gonna start getting the ball rolling again because I've been doing the like, ooh, look, there's stuff on the internet um, a little bit too much lately. So I'm gonna go find food and then go from there, I guess. Okay, geez, all right. So like, I don't know how long ago it was that I said I was gonna go upstairs and make food, but then I got another email from the electrician and then I was like, oh, the dryers, it's almost ready to switch my laundry to the dryer, so I should do that before I go upstairs. And I was texting my sister-in-law, and then he sent another email. <laughs> and then I was like, oh, I should forward this to her. And I was like, oh no, he included her as well. And then she responded, and oh my god. Anyways, I'm upstairs. Why did I, food. Why did I come upstairs, anybody? Can somebody tell me that? So, yeah, I'm gonna have some food. It's raining. It's either raining or it did rain. Huh. Anyways, I'm gonna have some food. I don't know if the food that I have leftovers of, how am I gonna fix this sentence, it's bad. You know, let's just start again. I don't know if the leftovers, <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. I don't know if the leftovers that I have from last night are enough to make a full meal, but we'll start with that and um, go from there. So, step one, I'm really hungry. It's almost two now, if that makes sense. So it is raining. I finished my lunch. One interesting thing I've noticed is the garbage in the house is under the sink, but the garbage at work wasn't, I mean the fridge was over there, but it was over here, like at the end of the counter. And so I keep trying to go there to throw garbage out, which as you might imagine, is not working very well. Anyway, I'm fed. I'm still a little bit hungry. I should probably like not fall downstairs. <laughs> um, I should probably eat more food at some point, basically, is what I'm trying to say. Anyway, for now, I'm fed enough that I can, oh, oh my room, oh, oh. try to figure something out here, I think, <sighs> or watch Netflix. Two solid options. Alrighty, so it's currently just 20 after four. I think I napped a bit. I'm gonna try to put my bed back together. Um, maybe like an hour at most and then I'm kind of getting hungry and one of the things that I desperately wanted to do while I was um, out being all remote was order in and so I mean I did order in technically twice I ordered KFC popcorn chicken from town but I just ordered actual KFC like a full meal so this is gonna be very exciting I'm like Bleh. I'm not feeling the best. I'm just tired though. That should be here within like the next 20 to 40 minutes, which is exciting. And then hopefully that'll give me the energy to go on to whatever I wanna do next. I was, I contemplated going to the grocery store. I was laying here, I was like, oh, what food can I make? And I was gonna make, what was I gonna make? I was gonna make some shredded chicken. And then I was like, what should I do with shredded chicken? I was thinking rice, and I was like, mmm. Nugget potatoes, like, in the oven, baked, roasted. So good, and so I was like, okay, I'll do that. And I was like, mmm, 
what about some panko covered chicken? And then I was like, ah, screw it, I'm just gonna order it. <laughs> but there was a long thought process to get to where I got to. I'm just gonna watch, I guess, finish this episode of White Collar and then maybe start transferring footage from both my cameras onto my computer so I can edit it at some point and then look at the list and see what else I should be doing. Organizing my desk, that should happen while I'm transferring the footage. Yeah. So it's really quite amazing when like you don't have the majority of your day dedicated to working because it's only just after six and I have been slacking so much but I've also been moderately productive so good job me. I am now back at my chair after chilling for a while on my bed because I ate food and it was delicious and then I needed to lay down afterwards. Um, KFC. Yeah, the ordering was, the ordering, the delivery was so fast, the ordering was fast, I was pro at ordering, but um, yeah, the delivery came super fast, which was nice, and um, my brain just stopped. And yeah, everything was nice, hot, and fresh, and I have leftovers for tomorrow, so that's exciting. I think I'm gonna spend a little bit of time getting this set up. Uh, for creative pursuits and setting some goals for at least this month if not kind of going forward because I got to edit book two again <sighs> and um, <laughs> etc so I'm gonna do that and I'll check in with you hopefully after having done productive things alrighty so I've made some more progress 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 I like tried to say it both ways at the same time and it sounded weird to me probably just to me um, hello so I discovered a flaw with this agenda here, the one that I was gonna use for all my writing stuff, is that the pages are thinner than the ones in this agenda and the other agenda, and so if I use these felts, which I like to use because there's all different colors, it bleeds through. But that's not the end of the world because somewhere I do have a million ink joy pens and colors, so I might have to switch to that, which is totally fine. I've organized my desk now. It's not perfect, but it's usable. Use oh, English. Why is it so hard? It is usable um, and a lot better than it was. I've got my laptop plugged in behind the desk instead of on the front of the desk, which is just wires everywhere. I've got my battery charger plugged in. I've got my other electronics plugged in over there where I usually have them plugged in. I'm finally charging my iPad, which I brought out with me this summer and I never used once. Good job, me. And um, yeah, I'm making progress. All my laundry's folded. I'm too lazy to put away right now. But I have, we're, we've come to the email portion of the day because I need to email my bosses. One of them emailed me last night because I ended up, she ended up not being around when I was leaving, so I missed saying goodbye. Um, and then I was gonna email the other one anyways and he emailed me first because there's mail for me that I knew was gonna show up the second I left. It didn't matter if I left Tuesday, or if I left Thursday, it was going to come on the following mail day, I was 100% sure. Anyway, so, it's really hot in here too. <laughs> I'm so ADHD, sometimes. So I'm gonna send emails. That's the roundabout way of what I was saying. Wow, wow, and I'm gonna drink some more water because water is good for you. Ah! I don't know what it is, I don't know what it is. Maybe, you know what, it might just be like, I have alone time where there's truly nobody around. Nobody's gonna come in and make a lot of noise and insist I go to a party or something. It's nice. Anyways, I'm gonna stop rambling. I'm gonna send those emails. And then I just transferred all my vlog footage to the computer. It's an excessive amount. Like, I would guess it's probably like 40-ish gigs. Oh, I, was, I mean 33.9. I was close. Anyway, so that is the next step, I think, is figuring out when I want to break the vlogs. Because um, I'm going to combine multiple days, but also I don't want to, like, combine all the days, I think. So I'm going to do that, and then after I email. After I email. We're getting there. I'd say we're over halfway through this list. I just sent my boss an email, and I ended it with a really bad pun. I am so fired. <laughs> It was like my favorite thing to do this summer. Anytime he'd come into the store, I would just drop a pun on him and I'd get like the eye roll and the laugh and then he'd leave. It was great, but yeah. <laughs> it's like when I asked if I could come again this summer to be the storekeeper and I said all I want to do is pet dogs. 
that was my email. Anyway, I am sweating to death. I should probably open a window. I am going to rewrite my list because it's getting difficult to read because there is so much stuff on it. Um, I have to shower at some point. There's so much to do. Where's my headphones? I need my headphones. I need my headphones so I can start editing. So I am in a full editing mode. I don't know if I've ever, I've hit that table really hard. I don't know if I've ever mentioned this, but so I listened to the footage with these headphones and then I put these ones over top and I listen to music because I don't, I just, I much prefer to have music close to my face and my head and my brain because it lets me, it focuses me a lot more than if I'm like listening to it far away because I can get super distracted by things. Um, I got an email back from my boss and so the terrible pun or joke that I sent him was how does Moses make his tea? He brews it. <laughs> and so he emailed me back and at the end he was like so now I had to look up a tea joke and his was how long does it take to brew Chinese tea? Ooh long time. <laughs> I love the um I love that I love his sense of humor because it is very similar to mine. Like one day at work he came up to me and was like you need to read this article and it was all about snail racing and just with terrible, terrible, terrible jokes. My battery's about to die so I'm gonna shut up and get back into editing. I'm like halfway through this video. Well look at that, it is 11.30. Like the entire summer if I stayed up past like 10.30 I was done. But. Hey, we're still awake somehow. I am exhausted. I don't know how I'm still awake, but I did shower, so that's exciting. I'm catching up on more YouTube videos, not editing. I edited a bunch, but um, I'm watching some now. I didn't do everything on my list, but I did a lot of it. In fact, the, pretty much the only thing left... Oh, let me cross off shower because yes, that was on the list. Pretty much the only thing that was left that I didn't do was unpack, but I was thinking about it and I unpacked my tote, my backpack, the cooler that I put stuff in, the other cooler that I put stuff in, so the only thing I did unpack was my suitcase. So that's fine and I really just like, I was really lazy and I didn't want to move that stuff out from in front of the closet door, so that's kind of why that stuff didn't happen. So yeah, very exciting. I am so tired. I am so tired. And today's going to be the first day in like 90 some odd days that I did not reach my Apple Watch Move goal. You can't see, there it is. I did not reach it and I won't reach it. I'm too lazy, I don't even care. I was like, I wanna go strong and do 100, but you know what, don't even care. I went from, I think it was June 12th until yesterday of hitting my move goal every single day. So yeah, that's impressive in and of itself. So yeah, basically I'm going to finish watching this YouTube video and then relocate to my bed where sleeping will ensue. Hopefully good sleeping, long sleeping. I do have to get up on, I don't have to get up early, but I have to be conscious for the electrician tomorrow at 11, so I will. Do that but yeah so brain 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 <laughs> what am I even doing anyways I'm gonna go and with that I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on month today's adventure which was my first day back in town I did not leave the house once <laughs> and I will see you tomorrow when I do very similar things good night